What's up guys, it's Organic Gaming and I'm back to you again with a new video on how to create a TSM add-on. TSM is a gold making add-on. It's a modular add-on actually designed to help both casual gold makers as well as experienced gold makers to streamline their gold making process including everything from crafting things to buying material to snatch things from the auction house to creating and cancelling auctions. We will come back to this but first Let's see how to download the application and how to install the desktop application and how to download the in-game add-on. What you wanna go first, you have to go to tradeskillmaster.com. Guys, don't worry about the links, I will leave a copy of them in the description. So the first thing you wanna do is to go install TSM. Once you click on install TSM, there's two types. Not two types, there's two things you have to do. There is the WoW add-on, in-game add-on, and there is the Trade Skill Master app, which is the desktop add-on. First thing you have to do is to go download via Curse. If you don't know what is Curse, Curse is the WoW World of Warcraft add-on handler, which will update automatically your World of Warcraft add-ons. So once you click on install, install via Curse client, your add-ons will appear over here. So for me, I already installed it. It's here, Trade Skill Master, blah blah blah. It's there are many six, seven add-ons, maybe or eight. They will go directly to the Curse client, and they will automatically install into your WoW folder. The next step is in the Trade Skill Master main page. You have to create a free account. In this screen, you have to create a username. Let's say. and to put your own email address for me i'm just going to use a temporary email address because this is a tutorial only i already have an account for myself and in the password you just put your own password over here you can uncheck sign up for newsletters create account so now we created our account you just go to your email and verify the email address. I have to wait a bit guys to receive the email. So guys, when you receive the email address, you just click on it. You see this link, you have to click on it and click to verify. Your account has been activated, you now you may now log in. So the next step definitely is login. Use the email address you put and the password. So now we are logged in. What you have to do, click on your username over here in the right in the corner and click Realm Selection. Once you are here, you specify your region, which is EU or US, depends. And over here, you put your RAM. Let's say I'm on Draenor, I click Add Realm. And it's done. We're almost done, guys. So the next step, we have to download the desktop application. The desktop application, click over here, and it says download now for Windows or Mac. Click download now. If you have Windows, you click on Windows, and this is one is for Mac. Click on Windows, save file, and your application is downloading. So for me, since I already have the application, we're gonna go straight away to it. We're gonna put my email. We're gonna put the password. So this is the TSM application. You put your email, you put your password, you click login. Press time, you click OK. And here it is. We're almost guys, we're almost done. As you can see, it says EU Drainer up to date. 
What does this mean to you? It means that it already updated your World of Warcraft in order to see tooltips in game to show you stuff about the auction house, the prices, the average sales price and everything. Before we finish, we have to go to settings just to make sure of some certain stuff. Make sure your WoW directory is the proper WoW directory where you install the game. You would want to keep run at startup so that the application starts straight away after your computer boots. You want to keep it minimized to system tray because you're not going to access the application at all. This application works in background. And you want to click start minimized. So make sure all those are checked. In notifications, you really don't need anything here. Forget about backup. And in advanced, forget about it. So we're almost done guys. Trade, trade skill master now is ready. The next step, you have to go to your World of Warcraft. Once, in your, once you are in the World of Warcraft, I want you to click on this Trade Skill Master icon near your minimap. You have all the models over here. Guys, this add-on is huge, it's very deep. I'm sure it's gonna be confusing for you in the beginning, but once you learn it guys, you will never play World of Warcraft without it. Sorry about this. So the next step, we wanna go to options and we wanna go to accounting. Make sure it's only says here, show sale info in tooltips. In auction DP, DB, you have to click on display minimum buyout in tooltip, display market value in tooltip, and display region average daily sold quantity. The other ones guys are really not needed. It's only for statistical purpose. So make sure you have one, two, three items checked in. And in accounting, you have this item checked in. You click close. Now, how is this TSM add-on working? Let's say I go to my bags. If you hover over your mouse over an item, we have a new tooltip. It says Leila chart, crafting reagent, sell price of course, that's how much you sell the price for the vendor. But what we are really interested with is mainly TSM auction DB. If you can see, it says minimum buyout, 45 gold, zero silver. What does this mean to you? It means that the minimum buyout currently on your realm for this item is 45 gold. So you guys don't need to go to, to the auction house to see how much it sells. It's on average almost between 45 gold. The market value, it will show you how on average is this market value priced. So it's a 79 gold, which mean, it means two things for you. The item has really high competition. That's why there's inflation on the server and that's why the item is selling for a low price compared to the market value because it's average sales value it's 79 gold however on your server server it's 45 gold all these are statistics you need to do, to know just just for your own gold making process and the region average daily sold it's 1183 piece of this item it means that every day in your region there is almost 1.1k being sold of this item anyways there is going to there is a lot of youtube videos and tutorials about this add-on. It shows you how to create stuff, how to create groups, how to easily make gold with this application. But today I showed you the basic stuff on how to create a TSM add-on and how to integrate it into your World of Warcraft and how to integrate it into your desktop application. Guys, check out my other videos on how to make gold in World of Warcraft. I'm definitely doing this video because on all my other videos I'm using this TSM add-on in order to show how I'm making some few K golds in game. If you see for example, I have currently 949,000 gold. Honestly, I just came back to WoW lately. I was not really, I, I played WoW until Cataclysm and I stopped. And I came back lately to WoW and I found it really easy nowadays to make gold. Guys, if you found my guide easy and simple, all I'm asking you is to click subscribe on my channel and wait for my gold making guide. Currently I'm making few guides about tailoring, jewel crafting and many other professions. They are straightforward guides, straightforward guides 
for the make building process. Nothing about RNG, it's all about farming, looking at the auction house and creating stuff to make gold in the fastest way possible. Have a good day guys, please don't forget to like and subscribe to my video.